Boom shakalaka, Bitcoin's already making new all-time highs and things are just getting started. Get it? Stay tuned. What's up everyone, Randall here from Crypto Love. Today's video, a lot of very interesting charts for Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies, including Bitcoin already making new all-time highs, maybe not in price yet, but also how things are just getting started. Before we get into it, guys, Make sure to like, subscribe, click the notification bell. Come join us on Twitter, the Crypto Love. Push that like button. Now, today, fear and greed, 71, the second consecutive day in greed. Again, these are the highest levels since November of 2021. The overall market, up 1.5% today. Bitcoin at 34,475. Ethereum at 1842. BNB at 225. XRP, 56 cents. Solana, $32. Cardano, 29 cents. Dogecoin 7 cents and Tron 9 cents. And Bitcoin finding support above this trend line resistance of this very large wedge right here. Breaking above there, now finding support above there, most likely launching into new territory. And I don't know about you guys, but it looks like also this trend line right here, if we can draw it, is also being preserved right now. Bitcoin finding support above that line as well. Now, if we take a look, over the last two weeks, Bitcoin has decisively broken out against the SNP. That's right, they are not correlated at the moment. After finding support on this trend line, it looks like Bitcoin is starting to take off. And if we take a look, comparing it to the 2019 cycle, finding support on that trend line, Taking off from there, it generally goes parabolic after not too long. Even DXY is breaking down inversely correlated with Bitcoin. As DXY continues to break down, not finding support right here, Bitcoin would likely continue to break up. Now, all-time highs for Bitcoin, maybe not yet in price, but the percentage of Bitcoin futures open interest made by the CME just reached an all-time high. High. Now, all-time highs and other things could likely translate to all-time highs in price. Also here, Bitcoin versus U.S. regional banks, all-time high. Again, interesting to note, right now, the MFI, Money Flow Index, passing above 50. Historically, this has been the levels that signal the beginning of a new bull run starting and things going up much, much Higher. If we take a look at the trend volume accumulation, Bitcoin has just started a new uptrend. It allows determining the price current price trend while taking into volume, account volume with blue color representing an uptrend and orange color representing a downtrend. We are just getting started for the beginning of an uptrend right here. Now might be a good time to consider, you know, getting in. If not for Bitcoin, at the very least for all coins, because all coins are coming up into contact with this upward sloping trend line about to leave the accumulation zone and enter the uptrend very, very soon. It seems like at the moment Bitcoin is leading, all coins are kind of going sideways until that changes and everything goes into all coins. Now for Bitcoin right now, we do have a bull flag, this bull flag target, $40,000. Bitcoin. We're nearly there. 34 something right now. Could be headed. Right now it's resting on the key June at 34.5, but could be headed towards 40 in the near future. I mean, that was my prediction for the halving, but hey, if we get it sooner, why the heck not? And it looks like we are moving into phase four, mid-cycle phase four. Right now, roughly $45,000 for the prediction in that. And you can see how historically in cycles that formed another top before continuation upwards. Right now, that's at 45,000. But if you really want to know what's going on, take a look at this buy signal. Still buy bullish signature down here, responsible for previous all-time highs. These were signaling, these buy signals were signaling towards the bottom right now. Also breaking above the two-year MA. Generally, this is accumulation period breaking above there. It doesn't take too long to get to the top. Target for this, 105 to two hundred and forty thousand dollars oh my goodness can't wait so that's all for today's episode if you enjoyed it push the like button i'll catch you guys later have a good one love you Peace. if you don't think bitcoin's going to a million dollars a coin and then ten million dollars a coin you're already a loser from now on if you don't own bitcoin you're a moron